Hello everyone, so in this video we're going to be farming Hassan Softskin, who's a Paragon boss out in the Plains of Jaren. I think I'm saying all those words correctly. And we'll be using a 600 HP Ritualist in order to farm him. So when you enter the area, cast the bonds on yourself and use your Shout Hero to give yourself a speed boost and run to the farming location. So you just want to run around this way so you're not going to aggro anything on your way there. And how the build works is that you'll be dealing damage using the skill Vengeful was Kanahi, Kanahe, I'm not sure how to say that. Uh, Vengeful Weapon and Pain Inverter. And in order to maintain your health, you have to use Protective Spirit and Spirit Bond. So when you get to about here, cast Protective Spirit and run in and target Hassan Softskin. If you grab the aggro of one of these Fangdi Boga, they'll slow you down. So just cast your Spirit Bond in order to maintain some health and just keep running until you get the aggro of Hassan Softskin and the spiders and insects around him. Now whenever Spirit Bond recharges, immediately recast it again because that's the skill that's maintaining your health along with Protective Spirit which is limiting the amount of damage you can take. So just keep maintaining those two skills in order to maintain your health and then just use the Vengeful skills in order to deal damage and put Pain Inverter on Hassan Softskin. And obviously whenever Pain Inverter recharges, just put it on Hassan Softskin again. I also want to mention that you could use this build to farm the insects that we ran past in order to get here. They were the enemies that were on the other side of the hill on the left hand side, and if you wanted to you could go back and farm them, but since the main purpose of this build is to farm Hassan Softskin in order to get Elite Paragon Tomes, I just ran straight here. And really the only hard part about this farm is to get past the Fang Boga. Uh, you could get two or three at a time in your way before you get to the insects. And because they slow you down and give you a significant amount of health degeneration, and Spirit Bond only activates when you take damage from an attack or a spell, you may not be able to survive until you walk through and grab the insects. So that doesn't really happen too often, so it's not something you should really have to worry about. So anyway, that's the video. If you enjoyed the farm, please leave a like down below. And if you like these kind of videos, I'm always making this kind of stuff, so please consider subscribing. And with that, I just want to say good luck, have fun, and thanks for watching. <laughs>